go from the crease upwards inwards from the outer corner outwards from the inner corner blend the color from the pencil into the MAC pigment color and look straight with the open eye and just blend the harsh edges don't blend too much just make them less harsh this kind of makeup is great if you want to round your eyes to make them look bigger even though the color is dark so now I'm adding the neck pigment mostly in the outer corner on the outer edges of my brown and again the q-tip I'm trying to blend my outer edges inwards I always want to keep this round form and again grab some more MAC pigment with the brush and add the color only in some areas of your makeup so mostly in the outer corner and in the inner corner to give more color to this makeup and again help yourself with the q-tip and then with a fluffy brush take some more highlighter color be sure to tap off the excess we don't need too much and again tap under the eyebrow and especially in the outer corner and now take the MAC pencil ebony and eyeline your eyes it should not be sharp I'm starting from the outer corner and I'm drawing a very very light line close to my lash line mostly uh, and I don't want this line to be sharp it should be soft as the whole makeup look and yet remember that if you have small eyes with uh, um, not defined crease so don't start from the inner corner don't start eyelining your eyes from the inner corner start from the middle of your eyelid Now curl your lashes And now I'm using MAC Blush Lash Mascara. As usual for such dark eyes, 
it's better to put several coats of mascara and as I don't need very defined lower lash I'm not covering them with the mascara but I just close my eyes and a little bit of mascara goes on the lower lashes and this is pretty much enough In this makeup it's better to pull your lashes upwards when putting mascara so to keep this round form of the makeup With a Q-tip take off the excess of mascara on the lower lashes So the eye makeup for this look is pretty much done and the next step that we will do, we will work the eyebrows over. So as I have already said, the next step will be eyebrows and in this look we will do round, um, not defined eyebrows, very soft. So compare this eyebrow with this one. So this one is much fuller. And we will start from defining the eyebrow triangle. So you will need your groom brush. Um, brush your hair on the eyebrows upwards. And first I'm grabbing the color from the pencil with a small brow brush and define my eyebrow here and I'm going a little bit up. So I'm going over my natural triangle here. And I don't go too far here in the outer corners. So I'm stopping somewhere here where my eye makeup stops. Then I'm taking my brow powder the brow brush and fill in the space again starting from the middle of the eyebrow and going mostly inwards so I'm drawing the eyebrow much fuller than my natural eyebrow the guys who have such natural form of eyebrow you don't need to do something more so fill in the space and go pretty much inwards the price the brow is not defined but still rather intense q-tip And what we're going to do with this outer corner, so we just fill in the color a little bit and we don't touch the natural hair here. And now spread some hair -like on the groomer brush or you can use the brow gel that has no shine. And again Calm your eyebrow going upwards.